Uh, good afternoon, good morning, good evening. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, wherever you are, I'm talking as uh, the ambassador of Quantum Africa. So I wanted to take us through the sustainability of this amazing opportunity called Quantum, why people are very excited, uh, those who have understood it. And for those who have not understood it, please listen to me very carefully, <clears throat> because I'm going to take us through a very short analysis. It's very, very important that you use this to get people to understand that we are not just talking because we like the project, we are talking because it deserves the credit at a time like this. People are trying out a lot of opportunities. I can tell you since, since this year began, I think I've tried out around two opportunities and I'll tell you point blank. I looked at them and I wouldn't go far with them. I was much faster than some of these opportunities. So when you have a goal to achieve something, you need a company that is bigger than you. If you are bigger than the company, it's going to be a very big problem because they will never move at your pace. So guess what? You'll be slowed down and uh, you have a goal to achieve at the end of the day. That goal is financial freedom. That goal is to help plenty of your friends make money. As leaders, it's upon us to give our people very good opportunities because very many people are counting on us. People are gonna call you, they say, oh, Benny, what do you have this time? I want something good to invest in. Or someone will call Alex, what do you have? Steve, what do you have? Peter, what do you have? You know, they are calling us because we have stood in the gap. They're not just calling us, it's because we have stood in the gap. So when you stand in the gap of the industry, it means that you know what it is. You know everything, you can do analysis, you can actually advise people on what is happening. Now, for those who will listen, they will listen. Those who don't want to listen, you let them be because everybody is entitled to some opinions. But you see, when we talk about common sense, you see common sense is very common to so very many people out there, but not everybody uses it. You'll see it, they'll tell you it's not common, but guess what, it's there, people are not using it. People choose to believe some things either because they have been bought or they are biased or they don't like someone who is in a certain opportunity. If you don't like the person and the opportunity is good, don't mind about them. Come, plug in, create your own line and start running. I've seen lots of people say, I'm not going to go in that opportunity because so-and-so is there. That is baby stuff. I would call it baby stuff. So money does not need anything to do with anger, wrangles or whatever. When it is money, it is money. Wherever it is, go out there <clears throat> and get it. Are we together? Because that is one of the bigger motives. People will tell you, no, too much money is bad. Who told you? You wake up every morning and you're looking for money. And guess what? It is in God's interest for us to have money. So let me take you through the sustainability of a company called Quantum. I'm going to start first of all with the ownership. From the ownership, then I'm going to share the presentation plan, which is our PowerPoint that we do every day. Most of you have not seen. I'll be going specifically to those areas. They are known as the safety nets that are going to give us this company for a much longer time. Some of those areas that the company has worked on to keep it here for more than five years. Yes, I've said it more than five years, so pay attention. Now, first and foremost, <clears throat> let's start from the company ownership. Before I joined this company, I had to look at the ownership. It is not owned by your ordinary people. We have a team of seven corporate, I would call them the directors that own this company. And I had to go through at least one by one. Some of them design systems, others are good at expansion and others are in government. So I looked at one of the people that is called Bray Braggers, who is one of the director expansion, the network expansion. This guy, is currently one of the biggest campaigning people 
for the incoming president of uh, <clears throat> the Latin America. And, and I will tell you something that uh, these people have images to protect at the end of the day, very big images. And, and because they are out there, they are coming out with their image out and we have seen in their history, they have not been part of fake concept. You see, once a thief, always a thief. I always tell people, look at the CEOs of these companies, go through one by one, look at their previous performance, what have they done? And then you can make a decision. So I've, I've interacted with a lot of them. I've seen that it's not a one man show. This is a system that is managed by over seven people who have experience in the industry. These are some of them are traders. Some of them have been doing arbitration. Some of them have educational platforms. And I'll tell you, we are here because these people decided to come together. So let me go ahead and share the compensation plan to pick out some of those important areas. We are even going to do some calculation here. We shall calculate a few things. Let me share. Then we see what exactly I'm talking about here. You, you, will, you will love this case. You will love this, I can assure you. So <clears throat> let's look at, I'm going to go directly to those places that I know make sense only. So this company already we told you is called Quantum. And uh, like I told you, Quantum wants you to go and chill, you relax, go sleep, you know, it will do it for you. When we say we are doing it for you, it means that uh, I keep reading some of these things that the day you learn how to earn while you're sleeping, then that will be the best day. If you don't do that, you're going to work until you die. You see, you'll work until you what? You die. So the company called Quantum is here to tell you that they want to do something for you. So I'm going to run directly to the safety nets. I'll be running to the safety nets because those are, those are the most important thing. Now, let's start with one thing here. I know most people have a problem. Let's start with the location. This company is creating what we call head offices. It is trying to make sure that it doesn't waste money in terms of transporting leaders. I have been through the plan that they are doing. Right now, we are creating a head office in Dubai. The office in Dubai will enable people from Asia and people from Africa to easily fly in. It is prudent enough for very many companies to actually bring in leaders to look at what they have, and then this creates confidence. Are we together? So they did not just create an office in Dubai. They even actually have a pure registration in Dubai too. And they also have more registrations they are doing everywhere everywhere they are in a, a place which has a, a location they legally be there and that means that they have done registration which is very important so dubai is going to be one of the head offices where is the next one now a strategy they are putting together is to put another head office in panama why panama because panama is the place where we have the likes of europe coming in the likes of america coming in so we are not going to waste money ferrying everybody from all over the world to Dubai, you see? Now that is one of the strategies. Put offices in different centers and these should be head offices. Whatever the office of Dubai will be having, the Panama office will be having. We already have another one in our Dominican Republic and, and uh, Santa Domingo has an office where most of you see us doing presentation from some leaders. So. That is one of those strategies I want you to understand. Don't take this lightly. Don't take it lightly. When it comes to transporting leaders, the company spends a lot of money, lots of money. And most companies are touching investors' money to transport leaders, to give them hotels, then to do events. They are events that not all of us will be attending unless if we really transport ourselves there. Especially if an event is in Panama, that is very far for people from Asia and Africa. If an event is here in Dubai, then we shall be able to attend that in a very simple way. Now let's go ahead and look at more in terms of sustainability. I told you the other day that sustainability is very key. Let's look at uh, the strategy called arbitration. 
in the area of trading because I do it. I do it plenty of times. Now, arbitration is a very good deal. It's not disturbed by the issue of too much fluctuations in the market because what you're looking for is doing simultaneous buying and selling. You're going to buy low from a low market and sell high in another market. It doesn't matter whether the cryptos are going down, whether the Forex market is going down, you actually know that here it will be down there, it's going to be high. Either way, when it's going down, you're making profit. You are not stuck on margin trading, no. You're dealing with arbitration. We are talking about small tenures. Buy and immediately sell, meaning you're going to employ a bit of AI, you're going to employ uh, some bit of bots here that are going to simultaneously buy and sell we have done it. It is called, uh, in, in marketing, we can call it uh, price discrimination. You can discriminate the price from one place to another. You buy in the uptown or you buy in the uh, downtown selling uptown, you see? The same product. Most of these exchanges have different prices for the same product. Are we together? So one of these strategies that I see is to keep us, whether the market is down or up, this strategy will be working and it will be giving us returns, whether you like it or not. Let's go to more sustainability. Now, the sustainability that I'm going to discuss later is what is happening in the NFT and also the, the metaverse world. We are having something very amazing. You people, you don't know the industry of NFTs. The metaverse industry is worth billions of dollars soon. We are positioning ourselves in a very serious industry. This is practical and we have created our own metaverse. If you give us three years from now, two years, guys, you will see what is going to happen. There is so much money that is coming in from the NFT and the metaverse platform. And because we are already there, that money won't pass us. We shall be part of the victors because it's not easy to create a metaverse platform. It has taken this company one year and a half. Guys, you see the company is only about five, six months old, but it took it one year and a half to design its metaverse. It has been designing it. And uh, I looked at one of the meetings we had in corporate. They are intending to invest about $2 million in our own metaverse. We are designing NFTs that are very real. They are practical. And we are only launching them to our own community. Once we have 100,000 members, and uh, once the 100,000 come up, that is phase one. We have a roadmap, guys. Our roadmap, according to corporate, is to have at least 3 million people in the metaverse. 3 million. Do you know what that means? That is what we call real money. And that is a plan of about three to five years. So if a company has such a roadmap of three to five, you need to have what I would call the mentality in your head of sitting and relaxing. All companies that are doing short-term platforms, they are lying us with short-term roadmaps and all this. Some are not realistic. Now, this is a realistic plan, very realistic. We are moving slowly. This is an app. I, I looked at uh, another thing that um, companies that design apps tend to stay around for long because an app is regulated, guys. You don't just bring up an app. It is regulated. It has a lot of control on it. It has the owners. It has where it belongs. So you find it is very easy to trace an app with the people who designed it. What was the motive? So you will be caught if you design something that is going to fleece people at the end of the day. So I, I looked at this, and it's not something you come up with in one day. No, you involve in money involved in a lot of money. The office of Dubai, like I told you the other day, has already taken 500,000 US dollars. And this is not coming from investors' money. It is coming from the owners of this company. They have money to first put into the project so that it can work. We are not waiting for your money to come in and we do things. No, this company is doing things mindless of whether the people are coming in or not. That shows you we have a vision to impart lots of training to everybody in everywhere they are through our offices that are currently coming up. Now, let's go and look at what we call the pillars. 
this sustainability is very key when in terms of of, uh, of a business we have to look at what the business is talking about when related to reality reality <clears throat> we are talking about six pillars that are going to make for us money and realistically do you think these pillars make sense to you if they do then it means we are not telling lies we are here with what has already worked we are not reinventing the wheel now the trading concept is a clear one the metaverse you have seen it's a billion dollar industry coming up the nfts are already making plenty of money nothing is coming into test no we are not putting your money into a test somewhere the apps that's where we are designing them to give you easy access we are playing in the cryptos like any other company but we are very careful how we are dealing with the cryptos as i told you we have one of the strategies called arbitration and we have another platform where we rent stocks yesterday the other day we talked to one of our traders we rent stocks where we are making between 7 to 15 percent sometimes a month which is very good and it's much easier to rent stocks because you won't own them you rent make money return them we have employed the mlm system like any other company to create awareness and anybody with an mlm system it means you're going to grow like bushfire so in terms of growth we have a system are we together but what kind of product are we growing now let's talk about sustainability <clears throat> using this executive plan that is my first analysis we said that you can become an executive in this company and make 1.5 percent on your investment per day but you can also do 12 percent binary and also 12 percent direct and what is the cost of doing this the cost of this is five percent of your package every month five pot five percent now i'm going to give a hypothetical scenario here we are going to assume right now we are about seven thousand people are we together we are about seven thousand people i'm going to pick a hypothetical analysis and say let's say three thousand people are executive i know there are more i know there are more. actually right now almost everybody is an executive and I'm going to pick the lowest, uh, probably nice investment package of $1,000 that is giving us how much? Only $50 from every person per month. $50. Um, that's hypothetical right now. But we have people who have 10000 20000 50000 25000 30000 packages. They are in 4000 There are many packages, of, but I'm going to take it down to the lowest to cover uh, because I'm doing an average of let's say $50 times half of the people that we have. Let's say 3,500 people. Let's say times 3,500 people. Right now with the few that we have every month, this company will be receiving 175,000 US dollars. That is every month, not even from trading. It's just from the people who are buying executive. Let's go ahead. What if tomorrow we have 1 million people? I'm going to give you an example. 1 million people, and we are talking about the lowest package of a thousand, and half of these people are executive. Let's do another calculation. 50 times 500,000 people that we might be probably having tomorrow that is 25 million shillings i mean 25 million dollars not shillings guys 25 million dollars do you know what 25 million dollars means it's not a one off it is monthly D does someone see money here we were discussing this strategy with one of my leaders last night we talked about it and i told him yeah i had done a calculation before what you calculated is right what happens three years from today if we about let's say three million people and half of these people are executive i'm going to keep my count at a one thousand i will say one thousand which is where we are having fifty dollars paid fifty dollars times 1.5 million people are we together this is 75 million dollars 
every month without even touching the trading. If you look at currently the 175,000, this money alone is enough to even pay the members right now because very many people are not withdrawing a lot. Probably the highest we have is probably 20 to 30. Then the rest are sharing some small 2,000, 1,000, 300, 400, 500. We just began. Right now in Africa, probably per, per week, the highest earner right now is probably withdrawing almost 500, 600, 700 a week, you see? So it means it is still possible for us to run this. And uh, one of the things I need to let you know is I tell people that the executive is what we call the A plus. In society, majority of people don't like going on the A plus. For instance, let me give you an example. When you go on a plane, the first thing you want to do is book a, a ticket. And a ticket that makes money for the company is the economy ticket. That is where everybody lies. The business guys are few. The first class guys are few. When you go to the bank, I give an example all the time that everybody else has an ordinary account. Few people are seated having coffee as they are being served. What does this mean? I'm also going to bring this situation here that we are going to have investors in this company who will only come in to invest. I'm telling you the truth and they will pay executive. So they will be earning 1.5. And that might be not the majority, those will be few. I am thinking like that because probably we might have 30% or 40% of the people in quantum going to executive. And if these are investors, it means investors, most of them don't understand the concept of networking. They don't know how to tell someone else to come in and make some money. No, as long as their money is making money, that's what makes sense for them. So it means the company is not going to be paying 12% to some of these people, 12% binary and direct. And that simply means that this money saved, we are paying only 1.5. Does that make some sense to anybody here? The 5% coming out is plenty of money to run this company. Let's go here. Now, I want you to see the safety net on this one. This is the default. This default is saying you are making 0 0.5 per day. Are we together? Very many companies have come with that. And then what they do, they be giving out 10% binary and 10% direct. And in one year, they are out of the market. Now we've come with the same plan. I know another company doing 0 0.3. For at least three years, it has been around doing something. It has no momentum whatsoever. But here we are having momentum. 7% direct and 7% binary. When we are giving you a 0 0.5 per day is manageable. Guys. Do we know that the majority of the people are most likely to fall here? I explained to somebody that this is very manageable. If 60 or 70% of the company are going to be here, then it's at a free cost. The other few that are the other side will give us enough money to run this company. We are not even talking about the profits yet. We are not talking about the profits yet of this company. Let me show you another safety net that I want you to understand here. It's very important. Now, this company comes up with only three ways of paying. Not six, not seven, not eight, just three ways. You have your return on investment, you have your direct bonus and your binary bonus. Are we together? In those three, it simply means that it makes sense. It's realistic. Three payments are okay to run this company. We are not spending money in funny, funny ways. We have not put ranks here to say that tomorrow we are going to spend money buying a Lamborghini for somebody, buying a house in, uh, in uh, Dubai or wherever, in New York, in the wherever. We are only here to give you a paycheck at the end of the week. We can only promise what is realistic. Now, this is a safety net of only three payments. It is a safeguard for the company not to promise what they cannot offer you. So they are here to give you three pays only, direct return on investment, that is uh, the, then the binary. And uh, this is what they did. Everybody earning 1.5 or 0 0.5 has 
what we call acceleration. That your package can only go to 200%. Do you know what that means? That if you're a networker, it means every week, every month, every two days, every three days, you who already gave us money, you are coming back. Are we together? You are coming back. How? You are making 200 and giving back 100 to us. Making 200, giving back 100 to us. Somebody who has had 20,000 and made 40, trust me, they are not going to downgrade themselves to 10. If they have made 40,000 and they had invested 20, I will tell you they're most likely to even put 30 this time. It depends how quick. So 200%, the quicker someone makes their money and brings in another amount, the better for the company. It means the company is making much more money at that level. It's making much more money. Let me give you this other analysis that I had here. When we talk about the 1.5% and the 12, we have networkers who are most likely to be on this package. Are we together? It's called the 12%, the executive. This part, let me explain it to you. There are networkers who come in the company and we bargain how they can start. Some of them don't have money, but they are networkers. So the company has put an arrangement for a few of those. It's a case by case. It's not for everybody because we monitor this system. When the networker comes and we know this guy is a powerful guy, he has no money right now, the company has an arrangement where it will give you an account to start. This account will not have return on investment in it. There will be no ROI. I have had people getting disappointed that the company gave them accounts which have ROI. I asked them, how much have you contributed to the company for you to start earning from it? It, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. It's not just your face, your, 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 your whatever, your image, your everything. We want results here. We want results. Before you start doing claims, what have you done? Are you seated on your past performance, the past victory that you did? Can you redo it? How sure are we that what you did before you can do again? What was, how effective was what you did? Did you measure it in terms of returns for that company? So if you think you can do it again, come and show us. Then when you show us, let us bargain something amazing for you. So I will tell you that most of the networkers are not receiving daily returns, you see? So meaning the company is not paying any money to these guys who are bringing in a lot of money. They are not receiving return on investment unless they buy their own package. So where is their earning? Their earning is only on commission. Does that make sense? Their earning, and these are the most active people, their earning is on commission and the commission is a lot. They are actually making much more money than the guys who are just earning 1.5%, <clears throat> much more than the people who are doing return on investment alone. So when imagine if you combine 1.5 and 12%, I made a few millions the other day with 8%. What about a 12%? Now let's go ahead and look at more safety nets. This, <clears throat> this we have discussed. Now, I told you we have only three ways to pay people, three, just three. And it means this is sustainable, it is manageable. Now, this is okay because everybody has this. I want to talk about those specifics. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, let's talk about this one. There is a safety net in here on the binary. The company is saying everybody that comes in and you're going to be a networker, are we together? And you're going to have a team left and right. The first pair that you will make will directly go to the company. What do I mean the first pair? When you put a person left and a person right, do you know what happens? You make commission, direct commission of either seven or 12. Now, once you've done that, the system automatically realizes that it has a team left and team right. And at that moment, it is going to pair and give you some commission from the binary. So the first commission that comes from the binary guys, it goes directly to the company. Are we together? Let's do some calculations here because I like this. Now this 
is mandatory meanwhile i want you to understand that this is mandatory so right now we have seven thousand people in this company seven thousand and i believe that um let's say only two thousand are just investors right only two thousand are investors and the rest have probably put a person left and right i am doing a hypothetical analysis. Let's say 5,000 people have given this company how much? $7. Are we together? That is already between $35,000 to, let's say again, um, 5,000 people times 12. So $35,000 to 60,000 coming in from binary. Do you know how many people $60,000 can invite to Dubai? I want you to understand at this level that we are at, if the company employed $60,000 and paying flights which are between probably three, uh, 600 to 1,000, you have so many leaders that you can invite and even pay hotel. Let's look at a situation because I'm talking about the lowest binary that the company makes. Let's look at a situation when we are 1 million tomorrow. If we are 1 million, it means that probably the investors are maybe 100,000. I know majority of people are most likely to have a person left and right, and maybe they may not continue. Let's say 800,000 people tomorrow are going to be one of those people who have put a person left and right, and the company has made $7 from that's the lowest it can make that will be 5.6 million dollars so if we are talking about 800,000 people times 12 that will be between 5.6 to 9.6 million I, are you seeing this money guys what can 5.6 million do guys do you think in a week this company can pay out even a million dollar not yet soon when we have over a million people it doesn't mean that everybody will be earning 1,000 a day. No, some people will be earning slightly more. We shall have money coming in from the executive, money coming in from the binary. The binary is mandatory. The executive is optional, but it's giving us slightly more. So we are making money from the first pair without even looking at the trading results. Do you see this safety net? I want someone to see this and realize that actually the company is making money. Let's go ahead to another safety net because I want you to understand. Now there is a safety net here that I want you to see. This company has opened up a platform and said, your minimum investment is $100. And it has said, your maximum investment is to infinity. But again, it is saying anything above $100, you can invest. So meaning, it is open for anybody who makes money out there. When they realize that they had bought a 1,000, then they see $250 on their account, which they are not using. They will put 250. They see $130, they will put 130. Now, our system is so attractive that it allows you to come in anytime with 150, 120, 110, 113, 101, as long as it's above 100, guys. We are not locking you on a certain package. We are not saying if you put in 10,000, you can't put in 5,000. You can't put in, no. You can put in 10,000 today and tomorrow you're putting in 300. On the same package, you're adding on. You just keep adding on. Are, are we together? Now, this is an attractive platform in terms of investment. It allows you to come in at any moment. You can invest any amount of money on your account without any hardships. Are we there? Now, let's go here. Let's look at the entry method. We are not complicating the entry method. Why? Because we have our own gateway. Now, this is something I want you to listen to. We have our own gateway as quantum. Companies are losing money because they hire gateways. Someone has designed a gateway. You have to pay them and also pay your people. And also, that gateway is controlled by someone out there. Guess what? It's very easy for the person to hijack that platform. But money is not kept in the gateway anyway. If someone puts there a confusion around the gateway, it will take you time to design another gateway. 
or to actually hire another gateway. So very many companies are having gateways where they pay money. We designed our own. And that's the reason why we can pay anybody without you doing KYC. I want you to analyze this word KYC. Know your customer is a system that most scams are using and people are falling for it. They see KYC, they're like, oh my God, this company has KYC. It means it is legit. Guys, we have been scammed by more KYC companies than the ones without KYC. Do you understand this? I did an analysis on KYC. Most KYC systems, why are they putting in KYC? Most of these are government owned. This is a private company, guys. It is private. So the due diligence that we do is to look at the owners, how legitimate they are how transparent they are, because the company has values on which it operates, the transparency. These people own their own system and they are willing to change people's lives. Yes, they have control because they are dealing with people's finances, but they are not going to refuse to pay you when you gave them money without doing KYC. Do you see this? When you were pushing in your money, how come they didn't ask for KYC? So why would they ask for KYC to pay you? Yet you registered on their system, they know you. They know your names, they know your details, they know your account, they know your wallet. If your wallet has changed, probably you'll let the company know. But at the point when you're pushing in money, they never asked for KYC. Very many of those scams, when they are going to pay you, then they say, where is your KYC? Where, do you know why they're doing that? Very many people don't have documents that talk about them, but they can do such a company. Some people have IDs that can't be read by systems. So when they ask for KYC, they have almost 30 or 40% of the members trying to get documents. As they're trying to get documents, they are buying their own time. That is called a delaying technique for a company to stay with your money longer because they don't have money. They want to stay with your money longer, making some money on it. And they are saying, look for your documents. We want to verify you. We can't pay you. Your money is there. Before you know it, the company disappears when you're still looking for documents to verify yourself. It is very annoying. So we are not going to stress you with any KYC at the moment because we own our own system. We allowed you to push in money without KYC. Why should we ask for KYC to pay you? Does this make sense to you? OK, let's move. I want you to see some things that most people are not seeing. Now, this is very important. One, we said we are paying every Saturday from eight to four, New York time. A safety net that you need to see here is the money that we are paid from Monday to Friday. This money, when the company pays it on your accounts and you see your return on investment, do you know that if you have not removed it, the company will get this money and trade it again? Are you aware of that? It's, it's not a bad idea. It's a good idea. The company will trade this money again. And guess what? I have been showing you how it is making money. And it will make more money from that. It will make more money before it actually pays you on your same money that you gave it. You have made money. You have not picked it. It will pick it and trade it. And then on Saturday, before it pays you your $3,000, it has already made another 1000 from it. Before it pays you your $30,000, it has already made some $15,000. You, you get point. Before you receive your 50 k at the end of the week, the company has made some $20,000 out of it before it even pays you again. Do, do you get me? Hope this is clear. I told you the 5% that you, we are paying in every month. It's not mandatory, but the little when you count it, it is money that can run the errands of this company in terms of expansion, in terms of creating meetings out there without touching the investor's money. And that money is not small. Even during the time when the markets are bad, when we are in that bad moment, we can touch on that money to sustain the system. Are you seeing sustainability here? Mm -hmm. Let's go here and look at what we call the 72 hours. When you bring in your money, whatever day you bring it in, this system will take 72 hours to pay you return on investment. Do you know what that means? It means that in that time, we are doing some trading. You invested $50,000. Three days before we pay you, we have already done $10,000. 
and guess what? After making 10,000, how much are we going to pay you from your 550,000? We shall give you 750 for that day. And we shall continue making that money. Remember, there is a lot that comes in. So every money that is coming in, we are quick to trade on it very fast. Very fast. We flip it, flip it, flip it. Before you know it, we are creating a sustainable system. I only told the people that if our corporates are not greedy, if they are not going to develop any funny things, this company is going to run for quite a long time. Now, let me give you the other final deal in terms of sustainability. This company has said every 30 days, it is going to delete unused volume. I want you guys to understand this. Unused volume, what do I mean? Then when you look at this binary system here, everybody has his own counting, his own days of unused volume. They do not delete at once for everyone, no. Everybody has their own 30 days. The day you entered is the day the system starts counting. When you buy a package, it starts counting. So don't say they are going to delete using the calendar days. No. So you are my upline. Maybe your days are on. Me, your downline, my days are over. My downline there has this. So everybody has their own days. So what happens? When 30 days are done, the system looks at what has been claimed left and right. If in your entire 30 days, you did 5,400 on the left and 3,300 on the right, it simply means that you are only going to make either seven or 12% on your weaker leg, which is the right this time. So the company will pay you 7% of 3,300 or 12% of 3,300. We shall only be left with 2,100. That money the company won't pay you if you don't have anyone pairing on the side. It will delete it. The following day you start counting your new 30 days it will have more volume coming in. Now, why is it doing that? It is avoiding to overpay on unused volume like any other company. But in addition to deleting, it has given you a chance to climb the maximum. How? That you have a chance to make 12% direct and 12% binary before this unused volume goes. Why? Other companies have actually seven to 10% on binary and direct, and they have the volume there. Now you, your volume is being slashed out, but when you count what you're making from the money coming in, it's much more from the other guy. Why, you are making 12%. Even when they flash the volume, you have made much more money than the other guy who is looking at the volume, because whatever volume this guy had, he only made how much? Seven or eight or 10%. I, I don't know whether you're getting my argument here. So you have a chance to make the maximum out of this compensation plan. So what do you do? Position your people in a very nice way. Don't be looking at 200,000 on one side and yet you have only 10,000 on this side. That is very unfair to you because 30 days down the road, you most likely to feel very, very sad. What do you do? Make sure 150 is on the other side, 150 on this side by balancing your leaders. And when you keep doing this, it's going to develop a habit in you of success. You're not going to sleep. You see a 50K, you're like, oh my God, I'm not sleeping. You start talking to every Tom, Harry and Dick out there. And that kind of, of, of adrenaline rush is good for us. You're going to run out there and say, I need to balance this volume before it goes. And in so doing, you're bringing money. There are guys who are lazy in networking because they are seeing volume. He knows any time I put anyone, my volume will come. Here, we are not entertaining lazy people. So because the system doesn't allow you to be lazy, it's receiving much more money in that rush moment. There is much more money coming in because you can't afford, you can't afford to lose your money. You cannot afford to lose your money. So money is coming in, money is coming in because it has created a system that flashes. We have an, a, a similar system like this in another company that was designed by this guy who called Junior, who designed this. This company is in the Dominican Republic for two and a half years it has been running. So do you get the argument of you being on pressure and we are receiving more money 
and the other company which is not flashing anything has some lazy guys looking at volume. They know any time they will climb the volume. They are not even bothered. Now here, we are bothered because the volume is disappearing. We are doing everything it takes to claim this volume. So hope you get that. Now, I'm going to finally tell you that this is the most sustainable system. Why? Because when they give you the 12%, they are also charging you 7.5, very little. So they are giving you much more and charging you less, but they are not allowing you to be lazy to look at unused volume. No, they are not allowing that. So in so doing, you're actually bringing in business. People have to realize that if you don't work within 30 days, you're in problems. You're going to lose this volume. But when you do the work, there is so much money you're bringing in and there is so much you're making. And then you have to start new volume. And this volume, because you have a team, it just comes without you knowing. You just see the volume coming in. It just keeps coming in. And another sustainability is that the company is allowing to pay a minimum withdrawal, $50. Minimum. So it is going to keep people excited. You know when you can pay $50? It means the little that someone receives, they will be excited. They will be very excited other than someone saying we are paying minimum 100, minimum 200. But you are, you're, you're, you're cutting off the excitement from somebody who has received some $50. That small excitement is breeding what we call results. At the end of the day, people are going to get excited that, oh my God, even this $50, the company is paying it. This is so amazing to go and make noise. You go and make noise out there. And guess what? That breeds some bit of excitement and more money for us. We are using whatever means we have to create excitement in the company. And now finally, the final safety net is the 72 hours. You know what 72 hours mean? It means within three days, you are paid. The faster you receive money, the, excite, the more excited and happy you become. You know happiness and excitement are two different things. <laughs> One is more contagious. You can be happy when you're not excited. Did you know that? <laughs> Someone who is extremely excited is extremely happy. Yeah. Are we together? So right now, within 72 hours, when you receive your money, any company that pays its people very fast is going to be here because people will talk about it. They will be excited telling everybody what the company is doing. Are we together? So without wasting time, guys, listen to this video about sustainability and talk to someone, send it to somebody out there, let them know that we have something that works. This is not working to your disadvantage. It's working to your advantage. It's working to your advantage. This is the best compensation plan that you can do in this era, in this time today. We have five months to hit 2023. And are you ready to be one of the victors in these next few months? Are you ready to be with us in Dubai this September? Are you going to do that $50,000? You, are you going to do it? It's up to you. Now, let's rest in Dubai soon because that is where everything ends. And we are soon beginning a new run of 100 days to financial freedom. We are bringing in a new program. We are just designing it. So be ready to be part of uh, all the top guys here because, man, this company is going to create millionaires millionaires in dollar you are going to be the first millionaire in your family please take it on and guys thank you so much and have a lovely day so let's stop here and uh, this part of sustainability here this is also something that creates more sustainability because we are open to allowing you withdraw from inside when we do that it also creates more excitement companies that do this have more momentum than those that are not doing it we allow you to have your money pay people internally. You can pay invoices using money on the activation wallet. And each time you do that, the company also charges you another 5%. So there is a 7.5 and a 5% here being charged at the moment. So that's money going to the company either way. So we are not just making money on the other withdrawal of Saturday. There are two withdrawals that people are doing. Some people are being charged 5%. And again, they're also being charged 7.5 because you had 1,000, you got a guy coming in 
to probably invest the 500 and you got charged for you withdrawing the 500. But again, on Saturday, you got charged another seven. So we are having those charges coming in all the time because the system is open for you all the time. Now, I want to wish you a lovely day. And let's start this week knowing, let's start the week knowing what we have. When you know your product and you can defend it, then you can grow. Otherwise, thank you so much. This is your ambassador, Ben Akiki, for the entire Africa and a part of Asia. We have lots of Asian teams, guys. So I'm going to stop this right now. And I want to let you know that we have a company. Are we together? We have a company. So have a good week, guys. Thank you so much.